Hello, welcome to Odobot YouTube channel. Myself is Ramana Krishna. Uh, today we are going to see how you can rectify few errors while you are working with robot framework. Okay, so here I have created a very simple uh, test case. So uh, I have used rphchallenger.com and uh, uh, inside that I am going to enter a few details like uh, first name, last name and all. And I have used the catalog recorder for uh, recording the test case. Right? So this is how I recorded and uh, let me do one thing, let me go back and let me try to play this test case. Here you can see the start of the execution, it is entering the first name and it is entering the second name and it is entering the address and other uh, details. Okay, So this is our very simple uh, test case that I have uh, created and at the end it will click on the submit button. Okay, so it worked with our uh, Catalan recorder, right? Then what I did is I just went to export and I exported to our uh, robot framework, and the same thing I replicated in our uh, Python IDE as well. Okay, so here you can use uh, here you can see I have used the same uh, keyword and uh, same element, and uh, below that I have just used only the uh, relevant uh, keywords as well. Okay. Uh, so here let me do one thing let me go to terminal okay or uh, let me do one thing mm, let me go to the folder to the folder let me open up the command prompt empty okay let me try to execute the test case robot test cases slash okay here you can see it is throwing a different different error no keyword with the name open browser did you try using keyword open and forgot to use enough for white space between keyword and argument? Okay, so this kind of anonymous errors we will be getting while you are working with a robot framework sometimes. Okay, so uh, let me show you a few of this kind of errors. Okay, so sometimes we will be getting error like uh, uh, this one just now I showed or uh, sometimes we will be getting like type error, web driver in it, got an unexpected uh, keyword argument, service log part. Or sometimes a value error, argument URL got it value, some some different different errors will be getting, right? So most of this issue will be happening because of the version issue between Selenium as well as the robot framework Selenium library that we are using in the robot framework. Okay, or the framework that we have used, right? So here also you can see I have used the Selenium library. So what I'm going to do is let me uh, try to get uh, the version of selenium and the robot framework selenium library so let me go here let me clear it okay clear is not a keyword so let me do one thing click mm. show selenium Okay, so the version is a 4.12.0. So I believe that this is the latest version. Okay, so 4, 4, 4, 4, 4 plus version, right? So this will be the updated one. Let me check the same for. Robot framework, Selenium library as well, right? Let me go here. So the version that we are using is a 4.5.0. So I believe this is a very old uh, version that we are using. Because of that, we are getting this error, right? So now what we can do is to resolve this error. Let me try to upgrade the robot framework. Okay. So the command is very simple. Like you just pip uh, install upgrade uh, hyphen hyphen upgrade. Then uh, which package or which library you want to upgrade, right? So let me enter it. You can see it has uh, upgraded now. Right. So let me execute now our uh, test cases. Okay, so now you can see our execution has uh, started. So the issue happened was because of the version issue uh, between the Selenium as well as the robot framework the Selenium library that we are using. Right. So that was the reason. So in order to resolve this kind of issues, what you have to do is you have to upgrade the libraries that you are using in your framework. Right. So I just upgraded this robot framework Selenium library in it and it executed fine without making any code changes. Right. So that's it for today. If you find this video useful, please like the video, share with your friends, and 
don't forget to subscribe our channel so thanks for watching the video bye